Boeing 777X's fuselage split dramatically during September stress test. Boeing got an unexpected jolt in September when engineers in Everett put the new 777X airframe through an extreme test of its structural strength. Just as the test approached its target stress level, an explosive depressurization tore through the fuselage. Boeing has kept the details secret, but photos obtained by the Seattle Times show that the extent of the damage was greater than previously disclosed and earlier reports were wrong about crucial details. The test plane is a complete write-off, its fuselage skin ripped wide open just behind the wing. A passenger door that blew out and fell to the factory floor was a secondary impact of the initial rupture, which was located far below the door. The relatively good news for Boeing is that because the test failed so explosively at just 1% shy of meeting federal requirements, it will almost certainly not have to do a retest. Regulators will likely allow it to prove by analysis that it's enough to reinforce the fuselage in the localized area where it failed. Asked for comment, Boeing said in a statement Tuesday that while it has not yet completed a detailed analysis of the incident, what we've seen to date reinforces our prior assessment that this will not have a significant impact on the design or our preparations for first flight. Related. More on the Boeing 777X. Boeing abandons its failed fuselage robots on the 777X, handing the job back to machinists or blows out during ground test on Boeing 777X jet the big jet behind Everett's big doors, Boeing Ready's first 777X to fly. Boeing CEO, lingering engine fix will push back first flight and delivery of 777X the biggest jet engines ever seen are set to roar on Boeing 777X. More. Boeing spokesman Paul Bergman said the test result won't add to the program delays already caused by problems in development of the jet's GE-9X engine. He said the 777X should still fly for the first time in early 2020 and the first will be delivered to an airline in 2021. Wings bent up, fuselage bent down. The test conducted that day was the final test of this airplane, which was fixed in a test rig inside the Everett factory specifically to be stressed close to destruction. The jet was surrounded by scaffolding and multiple orange weights hung from the airframe. Wires were hooked to instrumentation that studied the surface to measure every stress and deflection, the data monitored in real time by engineers sitting at control room computers. As the test neared its climax, weighted pulleys had bent the jet's giant carbon composite wings upward more than 28 feet from their resting position. That's far beyond the expected maximum deflectio. For more on this story, visit the news article link.